I think you were saying that there was something that really kicked this off for you as well, because some there was some event that where data was like breached or something. Is that right? Is it the U.S. Postal Service or something? Yeah, that's right. The USPS informed visibility data leak. What had happened with that that was really interesting. A month before the leak is published on Krebs, the API and web application were tested by the USPS Postmaster General. They published their findings. It's available online. You can still go and check it out. One of the things with API security at that time, there weren't resources out there. So there wasn't the OWASP API security top 10 available. So these testers, they go in and they treat it like any other web application vulnerability assessment, web application pen test. And they find a few, you know, maybe low risk, medium risk items. They don't happen to mention API in the entire report, but they do go over their tools in the appendices. HP Web Inspect was used. Nessus Professional Scanner was used. You can go and attempt to scan one of the deliberately vulnerable APIs out there. And the thing that'll happen is you'll come back and get results that are false negatives. All the scans will just say nothing is wrong. The issues that they do find out are security misconfigurations. So they'll say uh, that clickjacking uh, may be present, but it's not going to capture the other significant vulnerabilities. So with the USPS informed visibility API, if a tester had used it as it was designed, they could have made requests Something like if, if you made a request to an apartment building, you could use the address as one of the fields that would give you back information. And it would give you back the name, address, phone number, shipping information for everyone in that apartment complex. That led to this huge data leak that affected millions of people. Yeah, so basically someone was able to access other people's records when they shouldn't have and uh, was able to access millions of records, right? That's right.